Hello and welcome to another video from Hackology. Um, in yesterday's video we looked at um, a simple 5 segment LED display and how to map it. Um, I didn't show you how to find the negative pins out so I thought in this video I'd show you how to do that. And as you'll see we're looking at a more complex um, 4 digit um, 7 segment display. They're not actually 7 segment displays because they're 8 segment uh, because each one has a decimal point. So. Uh, let's start by uh, first of all looking at how many pins this has got. So what I'm going to do is just take it and push the legs through this paper. I know how many there are. There are um, out, out. Okay. so just push the legs through the paper. Just makes it easy to count and I can number them. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, and then um, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So there's twelve legs on there, and then when you count up, there's one, two, three, four, four lots of eight, sixteen, thirty-two. There's thirty-two LEDs on there. So how are we going to control 32 LEDs when there are only 12 pins on the um, LED display? Well, first of all, we're going to start by mapping them. To do that, we'll plug the um, LCD display into the breadboard and get some power to it. So, first of all, very simply, I'm just going to plug the ground in. And we're going to go to the ground rail. And then from here into one of these. <coughs> okay, so I've just chosen a pin at random. And I'm going to go from the 3.3 volt on the Arduino to another pin. Okay, so I'm just uh, just testing. So, what can we conclude from this? That none of the lights are turning on. Well, the ground pin must be either on a positive pin or it must not be connected. I'm sure that's the uh, place to connect it. So, let's just give this a try. Okay, right. Now, now we've got a light turning on, and I can see that this is pin 12. So, pin 12 is a ground pin. So I'm going to um, on here start drawing out my list of pins. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, and now we're going to start mapping them onto this. So I know that from this, I know that pin 12 is. Um, is this segment of the display. So what I need to do now is I need to draw my little picture down here. C, D, E, F, G, H. Okay. So I've drawn the um, a, a, a drawing of the segmented display here. I've listed the pins. We've counted how many pins there are, and we've found a ground and a positive pin. And this ground, basically, each one of these um, display segments has a ground, a separate ground. So this pin here relates to this um, display segment. So we know that this one controls this display segment. Okay, so we're going to write pin 12 is 
ground I'm just going to write S and we'll call that segment 4 ok so now we'll move on through the pins on here so we'll leave the ground one in and we'll move the positive one in fact we'll note down that this relates to A and that it is pin 3 so pin 3 is A plus All right. next move on to another move the positive pin that we found and move this round the breadboard until we get the light light up ok so we've got this light lighting up now which is F and that's F plus the three remaining pins one, four and five are going to be the ground connections for um, the other digits so let's just check that out um, to check that out we can so we know 12 is the ground for um, digital um, digit 4 so let's find out the grounds for the other digits so plug this into the ground and we need to test pins 1 yeah there we go so pin 1 is the ground for segment digit or whatever and we call in that segment 1 need to test four okay so that's pin one two three four so four is segment two and four is the ground for segment I should say digit really it's really a digit. And that must conclude that pin 5 is the ground for segment number 3. By oh, the power of deduction. Okay, let's just test it out. Okay, so what we're left with now is a list of pins. Uh, we know what they all do. In the next video, we're going to be looking at um, how we're going to wire these up to the Arduino and how we're going to display a different number on each one of these um, digits on the LED display. I uh, hope you've enjoyed tonight's video. Have fun hacking, and we'll be back with another video real soon. Peace.